what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to this College Football 25 Road to Glory Episode 3. We are finally the starting running back for Colorado State. If you did not know, we started off our career in Purdue or at Purdue. We ended up deleting that save file, started off in Indiana, ended up redshirting season one, and then we transferred to Colorado State and got the halfback one job after position battle in the last episode. If you didn't check it out, go check it out. It is a good one. But now, finally, we are going to get some actual gameplay. The only gameplay from before and here on out was only like little snippets, like three plays a game. Now we are finally going to be able to play a full game. We are 0-3 at Colorado State. I don't care what our record is. I am just hoping that we can play well enough that we can transfer again to a bigger school to try and win a national championship now like since i redshirted my season one this is going to be my real freshman season so we still got four years of this baby anyways i already did my practice i already did my weekly agenda let's hop into my first ever collegiate game starting against vanderbilt oh baby here we go in vanderbilt for this game my first ever collegiate start here for Colorado State going up against a tough team from the SEC, S SEC, the Vanderbilt, I think they're the Comrades, maybe, Com Commodores, one of them, I don't know actually, but this should be a good game, we're 0-3, they're 1-2, we're trying to get our first win on the season. We're actually going to start off with the ball and they want to run on the first play, I am down with this, CJ Lewis's first ever snap as a starting running back in the league and it's gonna go for four yards they're gonna run pass play here i believe this might be play action it is not i'm gonna be right here i did not see that linebacker right there we go for nothing and they're gonna go slants here on third and six i'm fine with that i'm gonna be back here blocking and they are going to be just short of the first down and that's gonna be a four and out or three and out vanderbilt does not score on their first possession I am back blocking, running play action here. I'm going to be back, and they're going to find a man, number 82, in stride, down to the 20-yard line. Brandon Fowler Nicolosi is, th that's not who that was. That was Brown. I just, oh, that was a quarterback. All right. Brown gets the big reception. And, did they sub me out? All right, they only subbed me out for a play for some reason. They must have went five wide. But yeah, I guess, yeah, that's our quarterback's name. He is a star, though. We're going to run a halfback run here, and our O-line just... I got three yards, but not great. And they're going to sub me out again. They got the first down, first and goal here. This is going to be tough. I don't expect to score on this one. I'm going to flip it to the left side. Uh, CJ Lewis, he's going to go like a yard. And they're going to do it again. I'm going left because of that middle linebacker over there. Let's see. C.J. Lewis, first ever collegiate touchdown. C.J. Lewis in the end zone. Let's go, baby. Put the crown on your head. First time in the end zone, the freshman, C.J. Lewis. Vanderbilt scored immediately on the next possession. Let's see what we can do here. I'm going to run away from the defender. Another four-yard gain. All right. Second quarter, third and four. And for some reason, on third and four, they're going to run a read option here. The quarterback is going to keep it. And he's actually going to break a tackle. He breaks another and he gets to the first down. Oh, my God. Isn't it? Oh, no. Oh, I'm bringing that back. Damn. It's going to be third and three now. That sucks, bro. Let's see if I can redeem myself and get it back. I can. CJ. Breaks some ankles, gets the first down. Not as many yards as the QB got, but first down anyways. Vanderbilt scored again. Unlike Madden, they take me out of the game pretty occasionally, so I don't think I'm going to be putting up much stats as I'm assuming... Oh, Vanderbilt gets an injury. Uh, our quarterback's 86 yards. They're going to run another read option. Hey, he did good on the first time. I trust him now. We just hope that D-lineman does not... He bit on, he did not bite on it. He breaks a tackle though, I think. All right, third and five. They got me out wide. Let's see. And that's not a great pass, but it's completed. They ended up subbing me out again for some reason, but we're back here, back with the ball. They did not score on that possession. And they're gonna just give it out to him. 
Uh, let's run a little. Nope, that subbed me out again. Great blocks. Great blocks. Oh, I did not get the move off in time there. Good run. 10 rushes, 37 yards. Not putting up, you know, eye-popping stats here. Only 3.7 yards to carry. But, I mean, I'm doing what I can with this team. This is not a good team, mind you. Like, Colorado State is not a good team. I'm going out wide. They're going to give it out to the drag. And that's going to be a first down. They ended up kicking a field goal. Getting into a one-point game. And we have the ball right back at the 25. Let's see what we can do. They're going to give it out right to the wide receiver. I mean, easy six yards right there. We ended up scoring on that last possession, but Vanderbilt also came down, kicked the field goal. We have a two-point lead, start of the fourth quarter. And, yeah, I'm just going to get absolutely blown up there. The O-line just completely collapsed. And we're going to go a passing play here on second and long. We need this O-line to be blocking a little bit better here. Uh, that, whoa, oh, he's got him! And he doesn't hold on. That was just a bad pass. All right, we get the ball back. Far back, though. Vanderbilt did not score after that three and out. Right here, wide open. And I'm going to hold on. A nice short gain or a medium gain of six yards. They, they subbed me out a lot, bro. Like, after every play, I get taken out. Taken out for a down. We're going to go slants here. Let's hope the coach is uh, not playing stupid here. Um, um, you got to get rid of the ball. He throws it away. Yeah, that slant was not a good call there. And just like that, Vanderbilt scores. We're down by five, and now they decide, oh, now we want to go back to the run game, which has been somewhat good as long as we get the blocking. As I get a juke move, and I'm going to fight second and one. That was a tough, and they're going to sub me out again. Okay, bro, this is, why, why, are we, why am I getting subbed out after every single play, bro? Probably the wear and tear system, but I haven't even been that bad. Let's go. They're going to give it to me. I'm going to juke inside, get three yards. Third and one. You would think they'd run the ball. No, nah, we're running a mesh option, baby. We're running mesh. Why Why? would, why would they run the ball? And they're actually going to get it. I'm going to get a huge block there. And we're going to get the first down, and they're going to sub me out again. Second and six. I got the ball. They're going to give it to me. That's all that matters. We'll see if I can make some work of it. Going to go left. Huge block there by the old lineman. Third and one because I got pushed backwards. And they're going to sub me out? 14 carries, 51 yards. Not a great game on the ground. And we ended up punting the ball. You don't. It's fourth and one, bro. Why are you subbing out your running back? Like, coach, what are we doing? That is not what you do. That was a horrendous pass. And they're subbing me out again. Third down. They're going. <laughs> oh, my goodness, bro. Our coach is actually so dumb. Actually so stupid. And is he going to find the man? No. Fourth down. We have to go for it. They're subbing me out, though. I don't even get to play. And that's going to do it. Our coach has to be the dumbest coach in the association, in the league. That was horrendous, bro. The play calling, I don't think I've seen worse play calling before. Just bad. I was subbed out. Look at their running back with 24 attempts. I was subbed out after every play. I'd run the ball, get subbed out for a play, come back in. It's a five wide. Like, why? I can tell Colorado ain't going to be the team for me. I just want to get through the season and transfer to a team that's actually going to run the goddamn ball. Final player stats. RQB, 22 to 33, 214, a touchdown and a pick. Not an awful game, not a great game. Rushing wise. Yeah, like, why? I'm running back one. Why is Damien? Bro, attempted 15 rushes. He had less yards than his attempts. And he had more attempts than me. Why? Bro, that's that's why I wasn't on the field. Because you gave Damian Henderson 15 rushing attempts. And he got 14 yards. That's why I wasn't on the field. I had less attempts. Quadruple the yards. A touchdown. And three broken tackles. And I was doing work in the air. Bro, I pray that next game, they give me more touch. He should not be having 15 touches. Give him seven. That's fine. 15? For I understand he's a high overall. He is halfback two on the depth chart. I am halfback one. I should be getting those touches, not him. I did more with less touches. Way more. Even this guy did better. It was the quarterback ran better than the star running back. <laughs> That's actually unbelievable, bro. Oh, great. He had one catch of 15 yards. 
Fantastic, bro. You did so much. You contributed so much. Our coach has to be the biggest moron I've seen on planet Earth, bro. Anyways, first of all, bro, name I'm not going to pronounce, 8 Pancakes, you cooked as a 75 overall red shirt. Absolutely cooked. Anyways, that's going to be it for this episode. I know it was probably fairly short. Only game one. We'll be back for next game. Hopefully, our coach isn't actually brain dead. So, that's it for me. GG.